All right, guys, we're back for another Dokkan battle video. Uh, no reason to waste a lot of time. Let's just get going. Uh, very excited here. This is the first long video I'm recording with the new nano tech setup, baby. I'm very excited. So previously, I'd be recording these big, long-ass videos, and it's like, uh-oh, is the audio messed up halfway through? Is, you know, am I going to have cord issues half of this video? Well, now... None of that's happening. <laughs> All right. Um, uh, again, I will remind you guys, the strategy is never to just, oh my God, just use the domain instantly. Definitely not here. Oh, should we? Wait, what's the next rotation? Oof. Lord, Tech Broly is in a bad spot. Um, hmm. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm trying to think of how I want to go with this. I I guess we'll just float in Broly here. I mean, that's presumably a little bit dangerous, but that's what we're going to go with. Yeah. All right. Let's see if I end up regretting this chat. Let's see. Uh, I like in Broly's um, transform uh, or his uh, revive condition. I like it quite a bit. Because uh, once we hit, you know, his fifth turn... Um, at least there's no other restrictions, right? Now, obviously, if it was, like, fifth turn start a battle, I mean, that would be better. That would certainly help out in some situations. Um, but, like, just fifth turn with no other conditions, it's not, it's not, like, the worst shit ever, right? A lot of revives are, you know, you have to specifically have this much HP or you gotta get hit that many times or something like that. So, Broly's works a little bit different than, like, a lot of those other characters' revives. Um, but it is, like, an end of fight thing, not a beginning of fight thing. So, at the uncontrollable power team, like, if we've got one weakness we have to go through with this team, um, it's going to be the fact that we can get caught early on. Not really in Broly himself, obviously, uh, but characters like EZA Tech Broly, EGL Dokkan Festellar Broly, I mean, more so if, uh, against an AoE or a lock or something like that. It's possible. Uh, okay, it would be very, very, very good for us. Oh, it's Super Attack Dodge, sure, whatever. That does nothing. If, if anything, I probably would rather have gotten hit by that, but whatever. Uh, we probably guaranteed win if Int Broly does not kill right here. Oh. Oh, ho, 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 shit. That's what we like to call a W. Because let me just tell you guys this. Spoiler chat. Uh, this guy is great. Um, I, I really have no complaints or no changes or no adjustments to be made. I think he's balanced perfectly as like a, an easy uh character but i mean he's locked in slot one against 17 we lose like well we probably lose yeah all right uh yep let me make sure to keep in mind during this video we do want to of course get rainbow orbs with our boy uh we're gonna be able to go ahead and get a super attack in remember we do need to get a lot of supers in um in order to build up uh super easy broly so getting a super in right away is good all right so on this next turn um, we're not going to have an Int Broly, but then we're going to have Int Broly's. Like, I kind of worked around 17's lock. If you guys notice what I did, I'm working around 17's lock. We just leave our rotations exactly as is. Again, I, like, when I was kind of, like, looking at stuff, I was playing around 17's locking the entire time. So, we're completely good like this. Uh, should we transform Tech Broly? Nah, let's leave him in base. Is it this? All right, we're going to devastate 17 right here. We're going to do uh, tons of damage. Uh, what we'll do is I probably will just pop um, in Broly's domain as soon as he shows up on this next turn. I think uh, now is the good time to use it. Because, uh, again, there, there's no point in just, like, willy-nilly wasting that shit. Um, there's no point. Okay, perfect. Yeah, we're looking good. Uh, so we'll be able to have, you know, Int Broly with his elite status plus the buffs in a more difficult portion of the fight. I mean, this is obviously a very annoying part of the fight, but 17 and Golden Frieza and Goku and Frieza obviously are much more of threats. Well, I mean, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I, this fight is so tough and so toxic because of the combination of powerful toxic boss mechanics. That's what makes this difficult. Right? Like, this fight is not tough just because of Goku and Frieza. It's not tough just because of 17 and Golden Frieza. There's many different, like, kind of, like, cascading factors. 
towards this fight being a significant issue to deal with. All right, Cell Max fully built up. We have Cell Max lined up for turn six. He'll be able to drop that bomb, his active skill, which will be perfect for us. All right, so we have Easy A Tech Broly, and he's in slot three, which is good. Yeah, this is exactly... Yep, perfect. Not killing sev uh, 17, or Gohan and Golden Frieza like that was so good for us. We probably don't want both Legendary Super Saiyan Broly's on rotations, but... Yeah, well, it is what it is. You know... Damn. Orbs are too good. If I could, I would hold back with Int Broly. I, I would not even super attack with him if I, if I could. Yeah. Uh. Uh, all right, here, let's hit this. We we can actually hold back one more turn. Now, this is probably holding back a little bit too much. I could have just used the domain right there for sure. But the reason I did not use the domain is because super easy a Broly needs to build up. I, I want to get him to build up, so I'm not going to use the domain. I mean, because Broly, if, if we use the domain, he does a big attack right there, right? Takes off a health bar of 17. Doing this, this will allow super easy a Broly to be able to get more super attacks in, which is exactly what we want. So now he's going to be able to get built up, which is going to be perfect for us. Remember, you got to play smart. Smart. I, I did the cell pointing at his head thing right there as well. I don't have face cam on right now, but, you know, you guys, could, in your mind's eye, you could see it. Right? Yeah? You guys saw it in your mind's eye. Yeah. Yeah. Um... Oh, we could use HL Proly's transformation. Should we? Uh, just the way I played this, now we actually could do it. Huh. You know, I... Abso... I could. Because... I think I will, actually. We're probably not going to get another chance in this video to do it, so I'm I'm going to use HL Broly's domain, I think. Uh, we're able to get away with this uh, for a couple of reasons, because, you know, we got Cell Max, um, we've got the Revive, you know, we got Tech Broly, like, we, we got a lot of stuff going on that will allow us to do this pretty safely. Uh, we, of course, are going to leave um, Int Broly on rotation. Uh, there's no reason whatsoever why we should float Int Broly. Because, uh, I mean, we leave an Int Broly in each rotation, and now we're going to have access to his Revive, right? Although, I guess... Huh. What if, like, 17 and Golden Freeze is super in the middle slot? I guess I hadn't really been consider that. And Broly will be able to live, right? Mm. Yeah, he's not dying. After he supers? Nah, he should be all right. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine for sure. For sure. All right, no super attack, sure. All right, Int Broly. I know this is a friend unit, so we know he has thirty additional. Go ahead and be a good boy and give us that additional. Okay, he did crit though. Sure. Cool. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, be a good boy. That was a that was a perfect time to get a uh, hidden potential system additional super, and he said, "I'm good actually. <laughs> I think I won't. I think uh, I think I'm not gonna do that at all." Thanks, bud. Uh, obviously, because Broly 
no matter what, Broly gets 100% um, attack and defense on both of his super attack effects. But on the 12 key, he could potentially get the extra defense as well. We could have gone just normally for the 12 key right there. Right there. Um, probably would have been a better idea. But the 12 key, it's, it's what, a 50% chance that he gets an extra 30% defense? And then on the 18 key super, it's a 50% chance he gets an extra 100% attack. All right, so they do live. Um, we will still just fire off Cell Max's active here, though. Oh, there's a super attack. Broly will be able to take this. This is not going to be enough to kill him. Remember... Oh, damn, that did a lot, though. Damn, dude. 30, 40... We don't have Berserker up. Nah, we're not in Berserker territory, unfortunately. Uh, I'm not... We're gonna have zero links up. Where's my rainbow orbs? Bastard. Hey! God damn him. Alright, we'll hit this. That'll get a little bit of support for Cell Max before we fired it off. Uh, we'll do this as well, sure. Alright, and let's toss uh, Cell Max's active. We might not see this again in the video. There's a chance, I guess, so let's toss it. No crit, unfortunate, but it uh, doesn't really matter too much to us. Uh, does Super Easy 8, does he need to do one more super attack to finish off? Or to, to fully built up? Maybe, maybe. We're probably not going to see Super Easy A Broly get to uh, do very much in this run against Goku and Frieza. Probably not. Because, uh, I mean, we can't put him slot one. I mean, I guess I could and hope for the dodge, but... All right, Tech Broly is going to be more than fine. Here, we've watched a lot of actives. Let's toss this. I mean, we could do we could do a couple runs in here. I'll, I'll pop that as well. Yeah. Is this? Okay, doesn't matter. Alrighty. Yeah, we're probably, unfortunately, not going to get to see uh, Super Easy A Broly. I think... There's a really good chance we just kill Goku and Frieza right here. Really good chance. That would have been a fire super attack dodge, by the way. Because remember, they do attack debuff us right here. Tech like Broly should be able to eat it fine, but... Yeah. yeah. Uh, remember that? he. This is still within his first three turns. Where he has the extra uh, damage reduction right there. Uh, so he did, the, it, he did the additional normal, but it skipped the animation. Interesting. That is still like a glitch that's in the game, huh? Still, after all this time. Zero, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, even if he crits on this, I think this is also going to be a zero. A zero spot from him. No. Oh, we did get it. Nice. Okay. 14.8. That was just enough to get him over. 56. So, obviously, this is above the threshold. Here, hold this. And wipe away a lot of their HP. Yep, that's... He basically did half of their HP right there. They have 100 million HP. did 41. <laughs> okay. I mean, if he gives us a barrage of crits, they're dead. This is exactly why I said we're probably not going to see uh, Super Easy A Broly because of this guy. Okay, yeah, this looks like death. Okay, so there we go. Yep. That's... Uh, see ya. Bye. That's what he does. Should we just hop in with the same setup? We could do uh, Tech Broly. I, I mean, there are potentially several teams we could run. The thing about this guy is he doesn't need to be run on, like, full uncontrollable power or anything like that. And his support is technically to everyone. It's more substantial to extreme class allies, but... So, like, what that means is we could run... Here, I, w once we get to the thing, I'm going to show this. 
Actually, I, I mean, I probably could just skip ahead. Dude, this loading screen right here. Bro. You think I enjoy sitting on that loading screen so much? The answer is no. All right, we're going to flip over real quick. All right. So, again, he doesn't have restrictions. Like, I mean, this is not a problem. But this is what I wanted to show is 200% teams. So, because of that, like, we could run this guy on EJ Broly's team, you know, with Beast, with Gogeta, with, like, those Rainbow Orb changes, stuff like that, um, and be able to use him in some different situations, different settings. So, that's that's going to be good. Um, I, I, I really, I mean, that's super easy, Broly. I don't, uh, I don't know. Um, him or Trunks and Goten, I, I think, like, I'm, it's close to me. It's close. Uh, no, I want to do double Int Broly here. We we didn't do Int Broly's domain at all in that one. Is there really no Rainbow Broly's? Are you kidding me? What? All right. No Rainbow Int Broly? What in the hell? I promise you, we throw up, you know, STR Kamehameha, and there's going to be a thousand Rainbow Gohans, though. Kamehameha leader. Oh, Japanese players love that. Hmm. Should we respect 17 and float off Tech Broly? Yeah. Yeah. We could take a ton of damage from Gohan and Frieza right here. It wouldn't kill us, right? I don't think so. Oh, we're going to get Tech... Carnival Tech Broly with a huge support, by the way. Oh, the big support. Yeah, no, it's not killing us. This will do damage. They do super attack right away. This will do damage. We'll be able to deal with it, though. Um, again, th this is me respecting 17's lock. AGL Broly in slot 1 against 17. Uh, Easy A Tech Broly, slot 1 against 17. They're fish. They're sitting ducks in front of 17 in slot 1. You don't want to do that. Carnival Broly, obviously, is completely fine. Carnival Broly does so much to help this team work. Even though, I mean, it's just it's basically just him being invincible. But he does. He helps quite a bit. I love Carnival Broly. He's so good. I think Carnival Broly, like, he's also... An easy A tech Broly, pe this guy, people will probably say, is a great representation of Broly. Like, in, like, in, you know, like, 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 bro the feeling of Broly dominating in the movie is like this guy shooting out, you know, 50 million crits and shit like that, sure. But, um, I think the Carnival Broly is like the best representation we've seen of Broly. Uh, okay. We're okay because we can put Cell Max inside one, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. All right, let's toss this. Let's get this out here. This is a time where the domain will help us, of course. So, uh, now we get the uncontrollable power domain up for us. We'll rock Sal Max on Sal 1, of course. I'll give him the type orbs, yeah. I, I shouldn't go super crazy. And we could hit this. Four rainbows is about what we could expect from Int Broly. Or uh, STR, super easy at Broly. Now, remember, the thing that makes um, STR super easy at Broly just so freaking stupid. All right, Sal Max is sealed. Okay, perfect. That's fine, that's fine. Cell Max builds up by attacking. He doesn't need the super attack, so this is not a problem for us. Um, super easy a Broly, right? I mean, we get four rainbow orbs. He's supporting the rotation for four key and 80% attack and defense. I can't believe they gave him that. Like, it's so powerful. I, and the thing is, is like, maybe you could say it's a little bit restricted because we do have to get rainbow orbs. It's not like he just does it for free. But, I mean, he creates his own Rainbow Orbs on a team where we don't need Rainbow Orbs. I mean, we could run that dog shit Broly Chai and Lemo character. You know, that mid-ass pack of ass. We could run them and they could, up, you know, suck up all the Rainbow Orbs. But which, you know, do I want to run this Juggernaut? Easy Rainbow Orbs for the whole team. A more functional, better team. Or do I want to run Broly, Chi Lai, and lose the fucking run every time? I think I'll pick Super Easy Broly, yeah. I think so. 
think uh, I think it's a easy peasy uh, decision to me. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Let's just get the HP back. No reason to uh, remain damaged, I think. How many supers did we do last turn? Three? Remember, we have to do uh, five supers for Super Easy Broly to build up. Yeah, this yeah, this is... Super Easy Broly is really good, man. I... Because I don't... I feel like what he's bringing to the table is super consistent, right? Trunks and Goten, I mean, you could go way up and down with him. Their ceiling is way above Super Easy Broly. No doubt about that. But, I mean, their floor is also instant death immediately. I guess Broly probably... We probably could see that with him, though. Like, he, he's not... Like, if we get a... Well, I mean, how is his defense after he triples Super's turn one? Like, he'd be okay, right? Let's, let's keep playing. Let's keep playing. Let's keep playing. All right, this will be much better. Having him next to Carnival Broly like this... Oh, I should have fo floated Imp Broly last turn. That was a little bit of a... Huh. Hmm. We'll leave maximum max on rotation. That's what we're going to do here. All right, how many rainbows we got? Two? Wait, one. No, no, no. One? What? No. <laughs> no. All right. Uh, let's hit this instead. There we go. Now we'll get two. Okay, sure. Um, So we'll do exactly this. So Super Easy April is going to be in a decent um, spot right here. Now, obviously, we did not get all of the rainbow orbs I would have liked for him. Um, so we're not going to have, you know, his full barrage of supers, but he should look pretty decent here. Uh, next turn, we'll have access to Cell Max's active as well. That's what's just so stupid about this team. I mean, we have so many target mechanics, revive, uh, domains. The one thing the team doesn't have, I guess, is a standby, huh? Which, I mean, doesn't really matter so much, but I just... More so an observation. Okay, pretty good. We got a crit there. Good. Yep, there you go. Guaranteed additional. One thing I really love about Broly, which I mentioned, is those... Nice, that's the hidden potential system additional super right there, right? Uh, the one thing I really like about STR Broly, super easy Broly, is his additionals are not, you know, guaranteed additional, the 50% chance to super. It's just... Guaranteed additional super, which is the shit I really like. Alright, yep. Get that finger out there, sure. Uh, looks like 17 and Golden Freeze are gonna just barely live, though. Oh, no! Hidden potential system additional super to crush them. Okay. Crush their souls right here. Looks like, unfortunately, I'm going to have to use Cell Max as uh, active. Yeah. Uh, wait. Damn, dude. Um, hmm. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Maybe I don't have to use Cell Max as active. Ah, we'll see. I guess, I mean, it's not... Here, let's, let's drop this. So, we'll get the domain back up. Oh, nice. We did damage. Good, good, good. No crit? Able to do damage. I, I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. Uh, my Broly would obviously be better here. Because uh, we could dodge. Yeah. Get that. Yeah, I'm probably just going to take our W. I'm just going to sell Max Active next turn. We'll just sell Max Active. And and get the, get the W here. Yep, there you go. Boom. Perfect. Beautiful. So that, that way we avoid the debuff right there. Lovely. Very good. Uh, we are going to need the crit to do damage right here, though. All right. Perfect. Well, <laughs> right on command. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, the team, it's pretty comfortable. Um, not exactly struggling um, going through. This is definitely the toughest fight in the game. I mean, the only fight that's kind of, like, you know, tougher, I think we could kind of argue, 
would potentially be the Bulma fight. Uh, for this super easy a Broly, we could hop into that Bulma fight with ease, by the way. Because we could just use the double uh, AG, AGL Broly who's attacking right now. We could just run his team. Uh, and then, you know, we put Gogeta and Rainbow Orb Changers on it. And we'll get through that Bulma fight pretty easily. AGL Broly and Physical Gogeta are, you know, definitely some of the best characters for the Bulma fight, by the way. Because of all their additional supers. Oh, actually, super easy a... Yeah, super easy a Broly. He's one of the best characters in the game for the Bulma fight now that I... Because, obviously, the Rainbow Orb Changing, right? But it's not just the Rainbow Orb Changing. It's also the fact that he gets the guaranteed additional supers with the Rainbow Orbs. <laughs> so, in that second phase, right, when Bulma... Um, when Bulma's lowering our key by nine... Whoops. <laughs> when Bulma's lowering our key by nine... <clears throat> Uh, Broly can get around that because he's just going to guarantee the additional super anyway with the Rainbow Orbs. That's really good. Uh, we could play uh, Easy Attack Broly's animation. We skipped it last time. Let's just get it in here. Sure, why not? Alright, so we'll be able to finish uh, this one off right here. Let's go ahead and put you right there. Let's get our four Rainbow Orbs, and that's GG. That's exactly what that is. Uh, yeah, Cell Max, a lot of, uh, the defense, is just know it's a high number. <laughs> That's it. Just know that Cell Max's defense is at a high number. Now, remember, just them targeting the super at Cell Max means he gets a guaranteed additional super right there. I would have preferred if he dodged it to have dodged the debuff, but whatever. All right, let's see what Super Easy A Broly gives us on this turn. Um, obviously, next to um, Easy A Tech Broly, I mean, he's going to be looking pretty good. We did get the four rainbow orbs, which is pretty much, you know, um, the best we're going to get from them. Technically, we could get them five orbs at some point, but that's not... It's just not... Oh, nice, dude. Yeah, look at this. This is a 2015 unit, man. Oh, damn, guys. I don't know. No, hit him, but it's just going to show normal. Oh, he could have quad supered to kill him. I'm sorry, don't worry. Don't worry, this guy's gonna clean up. Daddy's cleaning up right here, yep. That 80% support looks real good next to Father. Father Broly. See ya. <laughs> oh, damn. Yeah, dude, global players are gonna be funny again. I thought this fight was tough. <laughs> global players are gonna walk in with uncontrollable power. Oh, I thought this was a tough fight. Heard, heard this one was tough. Yeah, oh, man, it's really hard <laughs> with uncontrollable power. As long as you protect uh, some of these characters early on, right? Like, it's the team just really does turn into just a buzzsaw, dude. Um, I've talked about the Bulma fight so much. Let's just jump into that one next. We'll use double AGL Broly, bring our Rainbow Orb Changing Supremes, and this is going to be easy peasy. All right, guys, let's go ahead and hop in uh, to the Bulma fight just like this. Uh, so, like always, uh, Bulma has the highest chance of giving us an L, but we have plenty of uh, characters that could deal with this nonsense. Let's see. What are we going to get? What bullshit awaits us? Uh, uh, how about our Rainbow Orb Changer? It's uh, Assault 7. <laughs> oh, my God, that's so funny. <laughs> I love my orb changers in slot seven. Thanks, Stokan. Oh, God. Well. Yeah, chat. Looks like that is an L, I think. God damn it. Hit this. Chat, tell me why do we hop in this fight and then the Rainbow Orb Changers in slot 7? Is that really necessary? Is that entirely necessary, Bulma? Uh, okay. Well, looks like we're probably going to take an L here. Here, I'll, I'll skip through the rest of this turn.
All right. Um. So, what are we looking like? Oh! Did that boy Gogeta just come in clutch for us? I think he did. Hit this. Hit this. Oh, Gogeta. Goat Jita. Oh my god, he's different. Whew! Thank god for Goat Jita, man. Yeah, he came through. He came through. Beautiful rainbow orb changing. Alright, so uh, we made it through the initial toxic portion of the fight. I mean, we could do a second run in here, but I'm sure people wouldn't really want... I don't know. People probably don't want, probably, probably don't want a second run. But obviously, Broly with his orb changing. Although, not... Yeah, because his condition is just not bad at all, right? Uh, so remember, um, Broly, he does have a condition uh, for his rainbow orbs. Um, but it's really easy. It's He creates rainbow orbs if there's a planetary destruction or pure saiyan so you know of course the team is filled with pure saiyans all right let's um yeah it's about that time wish i could get four you guys think we'll be able to get four this is a little risky to do this we'll do it a little risk is good Now, Evolution Blue Vegeta has a 77% chance of an additional super, by the way. 77. 7 77. What do we think? We think this boy is hitting that 77%? We'll have Gogeta on this rotation. Alright, let's do it. 77%. Damn, still only three. All right, now, remember, um, Broly does support even super class allies. Um, he gives one key and 10% attack to super class allies. So, he is actually able to even help them. Please, Vegeta. No! We did get the hidden potential system additional super. Damn. Well... We need two from Broly. We got three. We have three rainbows. Hit him potential system additional normal. What an obnoxious fight! I, you will hear people. Wait, what? What? Wait, I saw... Oh! Oh, I did make one little mistake. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll not do... Okay, okay. Wow. Damn, dude. Um, Broly taking damage there. That was a little concerning. So, the family Kamehameha, they need a full rotation. Um... They need a full super class rotation, so let's not run them. Broly, though. Yeah, that first turn, he could he could he could take some hits, huh? Sheesh. Um We'll bring Broly in trunks. Yeah, that's fine. We have we have enough enough to make it through the fight. Wow, damn. Okay, Broly, Broly was taking some damage. I mean, I guess he was in slot 7, but still. That's a that's a tad concerning for Broly. The reason the family kind of... We lost anyway. Because, uh, well, I mean, again, because you know, people love to make excuses for addi their additional builds and shit like that. I see stupid, moronic... Play like, we lost... Like, keep in mind, I mean, you know, we lost... I mean, if Broly would have gave us the hidden potential system additional super, obviously. Like, so... Remember, we got the hidden potential system additional normal from from uh, super easy a Broly, which is essentially what lost us the the run. 
Uh, that is, uh, you know, like the Mayans say, uh, something. I don't know. All right, let's hit this. Uh, you wouldn't be able to tell we had double ramp orb changing on this rotation if I didn't mention it, huh? Yeah, this looks like a loss. Uh, we got bad luck with the rainbow orb changing, I think. God damn it. Here we go. This bullshit. All right, we have two rainbow orb changes right here, so we should be good. Haha, <laughs> yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Um, well, we don't want to do this, because then... Uh, I guess I guess we're doing this right here. All right, we're, we're going to be absolutely A-OK. -okay. Um, Broly and Trunks and Super Easy Broly combined to, uh, look good for us right here. Um, there is one issue, though. Whereas there is a lot of characters you build up by attacking, which obviously is, you know, super good for this portion of the fight. Um, Super Easy Broly, he does specifically need to super attack, though. So, in this opening phase where Bulma seals us, Super Easy Broly is not really going to be able to do much. If he uh, built up, by the way, by attacking, we also would not... Well, we wouldn't have died to losing our HP last turn, but we still would have lost because we didn't do four super attacks. I, I've said many times, but the portion of this fight I hate more is the part where we have to do four super attacks. Really sucks ass because, you know, it's down to, oh, let's pray the hidden potential system additional super comes through here. Let's pray Vegeta gets his 77% chance, which we didn't, by the way. Uh, I probably actually want Broly. Yeah, AGL Broly is like one of the best characters for this. Uh, I'll hit this with him. Yeah, this is not a turn we have to be fearful. I'm leaving that for... Leaving that for Super Easy Broly. That line of Rainbow Orbs right there. We'll just leave that for him. Alright, so uh, both AGL Broly and Physical Gogeta are super good for this portion of the fight. Because they do a bunch of attacks, right? A bunch of supers coming in. So we're going to be more than fine right here. Okay, okay. Alright, uh, this Bulma, she can do a bit of damage with that super. She can. It's the 77% did not fail us this time, thank God. <laughs> thank you, Vegeta. Thank you, thank you. Alright, well, while we're going through this kind of, uh, I guess, stupid portion of the fight... What should my next game chat be? What What's the ne next trophy hunting game? So I finished that Walking Dead Destinies game last night. Well, I say last night, but it was like six hours ago. It was like five hours ago. Um, it was terrible. Yeah, it was, it was absolutely god-awful. I actually did enjoy it. <laughs> but, I mean, it was, it was one of the worst dog shit games I've ever played ever. I really should have gotten like a clip and posted it to Twitter or something like that. It was so bad. It was, dude, it was so bad. It was so bad. I can't. Like, that, that's the type of game where, like, you know, you can get a footage of the PS5 version and people could be like, oh, you know. Oh, interesting, interesting, interesting. That's, uh, that's what PS5 games look like, right? Oh, a new trophy list just came out. Anime parody Tentacle Slayer. Might have to, might have to check that out. Tentacle Slayer, huh? Uh, now, I probably... I don't think I need to explain... Um... <laughs> what the tentacle in question is referring to. Dude, I swear. Hold on. I can put this in the video. Dude, I literally... Look, I'm so serious. I did not make anything up. We're, we're gonna get a little sidetracked here. My trophy side, I love it dearly. New trophy list, Tentacle Slayer. I didn't make it up. <laughs> you guys can see. I might hop into Tentacle Slayer, man. You can see by some of the trophy fixtures there. Uh, we can tell what the tentacles are. All right, anyway, let's let's lock in. Let's lock in. That's the wrong layout. Let's lock in. Let's lock in. 
<laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't know. I think I'm, I might, um, might have to tap into Tentacle Slayer, dude. I might have to. I might. <laughs> All right, this is a very professional and serious video recording. So let me, um, let's lock in. Let's, please, uh, quiet down back there. Oh my God. Wait. I'm actually a God at this game. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, I'm just talent. I'm just, I just am very talented at this game. Five rainbow orbs. How about that? So remember, for every rainbow key sphere Broly gets, he gives super class allies one key and 10% attack, and extreme class allies one key and 20% attack and defense. AJL Broly right now is getting five key and 100% attack and defense from super easy A Broly. Tell me that's just not pure flames right there. Pure flames. Whoa, whoa, goat! What are you doing? Hey! A lot of shenanigans today! <laughs> a lot of shenanigans. Oh, let me lock back into the combo. We will, you know, not talk about um, Tentacle Slayer. Is there more of those games? Anime parody? I gotta look that up. Okay, anyway. <laughs> so, what should my next game be, chat, man? I don't know. What is this Western slot machine? Uh oh. That's that that one. I don't know that I could put that up on. Uh... Dude, they know what they're doing. They really use anime girls to get people to buy those shitty games. And guess guess who's the number one sucker of that? Me right here. Anime girls? Why? Well, yes, I'm interested. How did you know? <laughs> How did you know? What? All right, anyway, Broly, we got to lock in. Broly, it's Broly, Broly, Broly time, Broly time, Broly time. Get going, Broly. Get going. Yeah, so I don't know what game to play next. I was thinking about Astro Bot. Um, I, so, so here's the reason I was actually, like, I'm not sure if I'm going to do Astro Bot right now. Uh, the main reasoning... Oh, that was a good dodge right there. We just saw... Remember, that damage we saw super easy a Broly take... Like, it's not like, oh, we're running him on, like, a weird setup or anything like that. Like, no. Like, that was just what he can look like. Right? Like, we got him rainbow orbs. I guess, to be fair, he had only supered once. Right? Like, we had only supered once because Bulma lowered our key by nine, so that first attack wasn't a super. But if he doesn't get supers, that's what he looks like. Again, I mean, his only condition we had fulfilled, which is a pure saying on rotation. So... Um, that was just kind of unfortunate. Like, he, he can be weak at the start. Um, you know, where Trunks Trunks and Goten can also. But Trunks and Goten, I mean, they do start out with dodge. By the way, in case you guys hadn't realized, I am 100% locked in. That super easy A Broly, he's either the best easy A TR or the second best. I'm not sure with Trunks and Goten. Um, like, 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 wh like, who's in front of who. Trunks and Goten, again, higher ceiling. Without a doubt, but... No! Oh, shit. Uh, we could transform with HL Broly, huh? Oh, I, I didn't realize that an the animation was on. Um, shit. I'm a little... Trunks and Broly, I'm a little concerned about. They could take damage here. And we obviously don't have Vegeta's revive up or anything like that. Could we kill Bulma? Maybe, but Bulma has... I think Bulma has 90% damage reduction, I think. We need to make sure Broly and Trunks have orbs. Uh. Oh, chat. I decided to bring Broly and Trunks. Let's hope we don't get punished for that. Remember, Broly and Trunks, I do have them mostly dodge, but... You know, obviously, it, it, I, I can't really quantify it as full dodge uh, because of the fact that um, we we need to give them the attack equips, right? 
Broly and Trunks have to be given the attack equips. Or the attack and the, the, the stat equips, I guess is what I should say correctly. Yeah, we're not going to kill her, no way. Her damage reduction is way too high. Bulma has, yeah, 90% damage reduction in Bulma. Um, oh, but Astrobot, uh, they already announced DLC for it. And, I mean, it's almost assuredly going to have trophies. Because, like, uh, Astro's Playroom, which I just coincidentally played in March for the first time ever and loved it. Um, that got trophies later on as well. Please super or dodge or do something. Okay, that's good. That's good. Remember, they get the damage reduction for super attack. No, what? <sighs> That's so stupid. Oh my god. This Bulma fight, man. I don't know. Like, Bulma, the Bulma fight is actually the hardest fight in the game, dude. This is the hardest fight. Like, the, the only fight I'd lose in is this one. This, this is it. This is the only fight that I, we actually get losses in. I mean, there was literally nothing I could have done about that. I mean, that that was the problematic portion of the fight for them. I guess I'm going to take them out. I don't know who to bring. I mean, we could do... Because it's like, you know, we take off a Rainbow Orb Changer, and then all of a sudden things start to get a little bit spooky, you know? Is there another Rainbow Orb Changer we could bring? I don't... We could bring... G Jiren could be... A, oh, we could bring Omega. Could bring Omega. Yeah. We'll bring him. We'll bring him. Yeah, Omega. I, I know it's... I know it looks weird, but I promise it works. I promise it'll work. We will win here outside of bullshit. Oh, we're getting this intro in too, by the way. Oh, yeah. This will work. Um, as long as we don't get cucked by additional supers. Or, I guess, rainbow orbs at the start. All right, all right, so we have, uh, returned. <laughs> I'm still laughing at Tentacle Slayer, dude. All right, um, beautiful opening rotation right here. This is just glorious, right? Plenty of rainbow orbs right away, so we're going to have zero difficulties with this opening garbage. Perfect, perfect. 12 turn one is nice. Um, all right, let me just skip through this opener then. Um, Omega is able... His debuffs and shit work the entirety of this fight. So, Omega can be really good in here. Oh, right! Right, 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 wait, 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 Yeah, if you get 12 Rainbow Orbs turn one, you do actually just skip through. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, okay. Um, you know, now we're immediately gonna go into... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Um, by the way, if anyone is curious, there is not another anime parody game. That's the only one. Anime Japanese Goblins? Uh, that kind of looks like a parody of Goblins. Uh, wait, that definitely is, isn't it? Uh, we're just doing a little bit of research, chat. Let's take a look at this. Anime Japanese Goblins. Uh, yeah, this is definitely looking like a Goblin Slayer parody game here. <laughs> okay, well, I might need to tap in. <laughs> okay. All right, anyway, again, jokes. We got jokes over here, man. You guys say, when we're doing a long video, you never know what you're going to run into deep into these long videos, okay? Uh, yeah, we're A-OK -okay right here. Uh, let's put Evolution Blue Vegeta in front of more attacks, obviously. Hit that. Plenty of rainbow orbs for Goat Jita. I don't know what I was doing. Yeah, that. He only needs one. Yeah, we don't need multiple rainbow orbs. We need just one. Yeah, so anyway, um, you know, the whole long kind of rambling conversation I've been having in the background about what game to pick. Because, again, we're in this part, we need to do four supers every turn while she's debuffing our key by nine. So, you know, we'll get there. 
Hopefully, super easy. It really doesn't get clapped up. You guys know the deal. Um, but yeah, I'm not really sure what game to play next. I had a couple people recommend Marvel Sun to me. I, I tweeted out the, you know, the pickups I did. So think about that. I really kind of want to play that Live I Live again, which is it's like a Super Nintendo game that got like a. I mean, it, it's it is kind of like a remake more than a remaster, but I mean, it's I don't know. It's like not. It is a remake. I, it, dude, I don't know. It, it kind of is like a. It's hard to say. I, I guess it would qualify as, like, a remake, but it's just, I don't know. It's really good. It's an old-school RPG. I love old-school RPGs. I think I might jump into one of those because I told the story. I saw the new Alien movie. It was incredible. Oh, God. Loved it. Loved it. Tons of references to the um, Alien game, Alien Isolation. And then I, I got a taste. I was like, damn, I want to play Alien Isolation again. And there's three trophy lists for it. PS4, uh, PS3, and Japanese PS4. Don't ask me why there's a... Oh, we got Super Attack Dodge, by the way. Don't ask me why there's a Japanese PS4 list. I don't know. I don't make the rules. I don't know. I just... I I, I play the game, okay? Um, So I beat the PS3, got the Platinum, and I was like, you know what? I want to play it again. So I looked into it with Goresh's help. I got the Japanese version, Platinum that. But I've got this Japanese PSN account now. Um, eventually, I'm going to make a EU one as well. Because a lot of games have different trophy lists. Because I, I... You know... A game like FF7 Remake, I'll probably play that again. You know, get trophies on, like, the EU lists and shit like that. But I think I might uh, play through Japanese Live I Live is what I'm going to do. Because I've already beaten it twice, so not understanding a lot of the dialogue and stuff like that will be okay. Although it is a RPG. So it's like we got to, you know, use some healing items and stuff like that. Hmm. Could be an interesting thing to think about. Could be a fun play. Could be a fun playthrough. Uh... Oh, should we? Should we just drop this right here? His active? Broly is not that much of a fraud that it matters, right? No way. Uh, let's do this. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so super easy a Broly is going to look much better on this turn, I'm thinking. Um, because on this turn, he's going to be able to get, you know, three guaranteed super attacks. So we're not going to have shenanigans happen. Um, so yeah, on that last turn, when we took that damage, that was a turn where we had one super attack only because there was only three rainbow orbs on the field. So we only got the one guaranteed additional super. And then obviously Bull was loading our key by nine. So we weren't able to get his initial super. Tentacle Slayer. Is that live, man? I gotta... <laughs> I gotta hop in. <laughs> we gotta check it out. <laughs> oh, another game... Okay, 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 okay. okay. Here's some. Someone will get a rise out of this. Uh, I've never played... So there's, like, the Trials of Mana and Visions of Mana and all those types of... Like, those types of games. I've never played one of those. But I remember in 2020... What really got me back into, like, playing games and, like, trophy hunting, it was um, when the, the, the quarantine happened, right, back in 2020. And, I, you know, I, I kind of, you know, that that's what got me on all this. Because back if you guys recall, at the time, I was going to the gym, I mean, six times a week. I was living at the gym. I, I've been hitting the gym good in 2024, but back then it was gym, 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 gym. And the gym was closed. Couldn't go to the gym. Where's my rainbow orbs, by the way? Hey, hey, hey. Oh, where's the rainbow orbs at? fellas i'm gonna just pop vegeta's active preemptively because this is gonna function as a super attack all right there we go um, so, I mean, there's no way we're going to have bad enough luck between all these characters not to get four supers in. Well, well, we only need three supers now. Yeah, there's no way. Vegeta, how are we looking? We still need some hits. So let's get some hits in for him. Let's hit that. That'll fall. So we'll get the EJ orbs for Big Daddy. Yep, perfect. Alrighty. Yep, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Damn, not even a super attack for them. Yeah, so uh, maybe I was thinking about that. Maybe hopping into, like, uh, maybe one of those trials. Because I kind of... 
I, I think I think I want an RPG right now. I shouldn't go too crazy and just get plow through every single RPG there is. I because I love like the old school JRPG shit. Love it, love it. I shouldn't blow through all those like right now because I already already this year I did Final Fantasy two, I did Final Fantasy three. That was the first time I've ever played those, I, and I've, of course I love them. I I just mostly did Chrono Cross as well. That's another one of my favorite childhood games. So to go to another RPG, but I just got that that itch, bro. I, I just gotta scratch it, man. Yeah, Trials of Mana. Like, what's the full series? Damn, there's ten games of trophies. Adventures of Mana, that's on the Vita. Secret of Mana, Trials of Mana, Legend of Mana, and Visions of Mana. That's the one that just came out, right? So I could hop into Secret of Mana? I might do it. This came out uh, February of 2018. I bought this in 2020. And then there's also Trials of Mana. April of 2020. Yeah, that, that's what got me to buy them. Because, the, yeah, 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 perfect, perfect, yep. That, so when that game came out back in 2020, that's when I kind of like, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I might do Secret of Mana. Because that, that's a remake of a super old school, like, Super Nintendo RPG as well, right? I might hop into it. I think so. All right, anyway, we could lock in. Bulma's giving us a lot of trouble here. Let's let's fire it up. Time to disintegrate uh, Bulma-chan. Um, let's, here. Let's get Gogeta to transform. So, okay, this is turn five. I actually would like to see... Oh, shit, dude. Damn, I wish we had... I wish Broly could transform right here, man. Oh, boy. I I really would like Super Easy Broly to be able to tank against Bulma, but we might not get a chance to see it. Damn, three again. I had to give Gogeta key. This is alright. It's fine. Alright. Alright, let's see how it goes. I couldn't put AGL Broly there. If she would have supered, she didn't. We could have we could have gotten away with AGL Broly right there. If she had supered, she would have killed AGL Broly. She'd kill him. This Bulma doesn't hit. Like, she's not like, oh my god. Wow, you know, watch out for her. But she's also not like, a, like, you know. Well, I mean, I don't. I, she does like 1.9 or something like that. Which I guess is kind of. I mean, that is baby. On turn 5, 1.9 nowadays, that's baby mode. But AJ probably wouldn't be able to sit there. Okay, sure. All right, super easy, Broly. I have not kept track. I've been talking about Tentacle Slayer and too much shit during this run. <laughs> I've, I've not really been. I've been busy explaining shit more so than. But it was a good conversation I had with y'all. I mean, maybe it was a conversation with myself. But I, I, I might, I might do Secret of Mana, man. I think so. I think that might be what, what I'm locking into. The platinum is an 18 percent. 5.2% on PSN. Let's pull up the trophy guide. Difficulty is a 3 out of 10, 1 playthrough, 25 hours. That's not exactly crazy. I I, I think I think I'm gonna jump into it. Yeah, because I bought that game four years ago. That's why like people see like, me buying games and they're like, oh wow, you're really gonna have time to do that before sparking. It's like, well, listen, I mean I I, I bought I, I bought like 50 games in 2020 during lockdown, man. And I haven't gotten to most of it. Like, God of War, I, I'm pretty sure I bought God of War. And I bought the 2018 Spider-Man. I bought those during the lockout, lockdown. I only played Spider-Man. Well, damn, actually, all of a sudden, Spider-Man was a year ago now, huh? Holy shit. Uh, okay. 
I'm gonna use Omega's active right here, and you might go, well, why would you do that? And the reason is because this is our last chance we're gonna get to see it in this run, I'm pretty sure. Alrighty, so there we go. Um, I, again, I just wanted to get that in there. Um, let's go ahead and transform EJL Broly, too. This will buff, obviously, like Super Easy A Broly and stuff like that. Um, and then EJL Broly will be able to disintegrate Bulma, finish her off on her second turn. Okay, perfect. Uh, we can just leave uh, Evolution Blue Vegeta right there. Yep, fine. Hit auto right here. Yeah, it, as insane as it sounds, Omega with no other GT boss allies is very helpful. <laughs> like in the Bulma fight, I you know I like I I like to call the Goku and Frieza fight the hardest, but I mean maybe this this is actually the fight that sets the standard right here. Is this one? This is the only fight I consistently lose in. Is this? And it's because of the bullshit. But ah, <sighs> all right, well. Listen, I am going to be so mad if he doesn't come through. I don't want to use his active because we, at some point, we got to get footage of Broly in here. We're going to be able to get four with him still. Gogeta, dude. Ugh, I'm going to be so mad. I might... Wait, what? Dude, please. No, we need four. See, now remember, I told people I really would like... Whatever. Here, we'll just... Yeah, damn it. All right, guys. Um, Again, please, Gogeta, man. Do not make me angry. So we did this before, and it didn't fall the way I wanted it to. Let's do this. No, dude. Damn. We need to... I need to get him... All right, guys. Um, well, that really sucks. It, you know, it does. Doesn't it seem like we'd be able to? No, this is four. This is four. This is four right here. Oh, nope. no matter what. Damn, I. You know, you would think. We would have enough orbs with three rainbow orb changes on rotation, huh? You'd think. You'd think. All right, guys. So we're going to have to just do the unthinkable here. Which is this. Now, did you guys enjoy this whole long segment we just did? Which is then going to just lead to Gogeta getting hit instantly and dying? We're only going to be able to get three with them. Gogeta, dude. Don't you dare. If I use Gogeta's active, Broly doesn't even get targeted, which is why I did this. Phew, thank God. Okay. That's obviously why I did this. You guys get it, right? Like, ever, we all get we all get why I did that. It's because, like, we're... At, eventually, I mean, at Super Easy at Broly, he is a character. He's never going to be in slot one. He is mostly just functioning as a support and stuff like that, but... Like, eventually, we're gonna... Like, we gotta show him in front of these boss attacks. Uh, let's hope she's not supering. Uh, he... Uh, there's no way he's living a super, right? He's definitely fully built up, right? So, we don't... Like, we're, we are fully built up right here. And it's not like we're on a weird team or anything like that. Well, I guess we are on a weird team, but he... Th this is a fine situation for Broly himself. We're on a 200% leader skill. His only condition is fulfilled, which is rainbow changing anyway. Quad super? Nope. Hit him with 10 system from normal. Oh my god. She actually did that. Yeah, so again, he's a full dodge character, of course. Yeah, I mean, Bulma, uh, truthfully, is different. So, by the way, can we just talk about this? Twice, 
in this godforsaken fight, there's been one attack in the middle, and Bulma has killed us. <laughs> in the one attack in the middle. I think... Okay. Uh, now, we've spent a lot of time in here. We're going to finish this up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just run it back with the same setup. Yeah. But I'm going to skip to Tech Bulma. Uh, because, I mean, we've had, you know, we've had a lot of, a lot of hilarity has been had during this sequence. A lot of fun. But I'm going to go ahead and skip to, t we'll come back at Tech Bulma right here. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. Um, let's... Oh, let, let's use their active, actually. Yeah, why not? But we're, we're having fun. We're having a grand old time here. Alright guys, so let's just hope that we don't get absolutely just blasted by Bulma again. I mean, you know, that was kind of just bad luck. But I mean, we do see the limitations of Super Easy A Broly. Um, I mean, we could say if we were running like full uncontrollable power, which... I mean, we could win with, with full uncontrollable power in here. But understand it is going to be very difficult. Um, because of the need for rainbow orbs. I... Like, that, like, if we really wanted to say, like, what's the best team in the game? And, like, we start really hammering that conversation. I mean, I do think this Bulma fight needs to be respected. I, like, I know a lot of people don't like the, you know, the initial phase. More so the Rainbow Orb changing, I think, even in the phase where you need to do super attacks. But at the same time, this is the only fight that's actually really challenging me, man. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um... But, like, you know, okay, so, like, let's say we're on full uncontrollable power. Like, Int Broly could have brought us back with a revive or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, just because a support character gets killed by, like, a three-plus million super, though, it's not the biggest deal. I mean, I could live with what Super Easy Broly's bringing to the table. You know, 60 and 80% support every single rotation while being able to deal with normals effectively. Like, I, maybe that sounds a little bit like Cope, but I'm okay with support characters, like, you know, like, being able to get killed by four million supers, but can tank normals. That's okay. Uh, but what it does open up the discussion towards is, is Trunks and Goten better? Maybe so, but, I, I mean, we have to respect the support. The support that... Broly is putting up on all these turns, man. Guess what? It matters. It really does. We're gonna need to get some more footage in. For sure, for sure. We need to do the Cell Max fight. Because I want to see Broly kind of like at the start of the fight against a tough enemy. Cell Max would be that. Uh, Blue Kyle, Ken, Evolution, Blue Vegeta aren't gonna work as effectively because Broly has type advantage on them. All right, we have Vegeta's Revive here. Yep, we do. Got this. Do we have, uh... It's only three. That's four. Yeah, let's do it. Vegeta will save us. Yeah. Shoutouts to Vegeta, bruh. All right, let's see how we do. Um, Broly... I think is fully built up. I mean, he'll definitely be fully built up after this. It's turn seven. Yeah, he's fully built up. Okay. All right. Hopefully Bulma doesn't open with a super attack right away. Because I'd like to see Broly against normals as well. But, I mean, outside of... Only Evolution Blue Vegeta would be able to tank Bulma, right? Uh, In terms of her super. I don't think AJL Broly wouldn't be able to. Would he? I guess maybe. Would he does have true type advantage. Good damage. Ah, uh, he's still taking damage, huh? Mm. That's... W what exactly is Bulma's damage right here? I gotta get the exact number. 
That's a little concerning. That right there, I, I mean, you know, what I just said. I could live with him dying to a 3 million plus super, sure. But, I mean, we gotta be able to double digit tank normals, man. Okay, Broly is dead here. Vegeta will come back. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, he died. <laughs> Okay, I forgot. Like, okay, listen. Bulma's the dark god and all that. Like, yeah. I I forgot how much of the dark god she actually is. Check this out, dude. So, I mean, like, you just take a quick glance at her. She hasn't seemed too intimidating, right? Like, 2.2. But she gets 100% attack right away. So that doubles it. So her super is 4 million. But her at normals are like 1.7 million. Dude. My god. That's turn one. Keep in mind that on the turn we're on right now, she has an extra 100% goddamn attack. Yeah, I, bro. I'm leaning every day towards this being the hardest fight. It's just... You guys can see it, right? I'll let y'all argue that amongst yourselves. Um, but this looks like this might be the dirtiest uh, fight that there is. Oh, what do we have here? Let's use Gogeta's. I'm going to play the Omega animation again, and let's see if we can't get the Omega KO screen, the super rare Omega KO screen. Hello? <laughs> Alright guys, we should be able to wrap uh, this shit up right here. Um, obviously with Gogeta, right? Alright, let's do that. <laughs> um... That's fine. And that is going to be that. Um, Gogeta, obviously, is going to have guaranteed crits towards the end. So these normals right here, I mean, these would be a death sentence against Super Easy Broly. So, all right. So Super Easy Broly, he was taking, like, 50k. Now, remember, we have we have AGL Broly's domain is up buffing STR Broly, too. Yeah, I... I, uh, man, there are some limitations. Maybe, maybe I should settle with Super Easy Broly as two behind Trunks and Goten. I, I, I maybe think so. Um, I mean, I would be really impressed. Like, if he had tanked those normals for double digits, that would have been really awesome. But, I mean, she hits really hard. Like, this is where you could see how, you know, interesting characters are. Now, keep in mind... Um, let's say we have in Broly, you know, throwing up his domain, um, and then he could stun Bulma, and I'll often, like, it is true, like, Bulma can be, she's susceptible to every debuff there is, as you guys can see. We can hit her with everything. That is factual. We're gonna kill her, right? W wait, why, why does she have so much HP left? I was talking, Blue Kaken and, and Goku, they didn't do anything? Or Blue Kaken and Vegeta? Oh my god, this isn't over. No, no, we're we're fine. We're fine. Because Omega... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Omega... Yeah, yeah. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Omega locked her down. Again, Omega's great for this fight. But, okay. Like, you could stun her and shit like that. But remember... 
I mean, Bulma, you know, dictates what you're doing. She could attack first, unless we're going to nuke her with the family coming him or something like that. Yeah, we're fine. <gasps> oh, I mean, I know winning is like, well, Broly will kill her. I mean, we got four. He'll kill her. He'll kill her. If we wanted to win, we put each up rolling saw one, but... Damn, all we have is... Fierce Battle and Super Saiyan. Right, yeah, this guy does not prepare for battle. This Broly? He came out... Uh, this boy came out before prepare for battle was a thing, I think. That right there, that should be prepare for battle. You know, it really would be fire if, like... Like, I get, like, super easy it's just for the passive. I mean, they said that, but... Like, it would be really fire if they were like, Yeah, we said just passive, but... I mean, if you don't have a full Link set, like, we could just, like... I mean, prepare for battle would be nice. Like, let's just, you know... I'm just saying. It would be nice. It would be nice. I would love to see Broly uh, take these normals. I didn't see how many supers Goku and Vegeta did last turn. Remember, they debuff every turn. Uh, Omega has a debuff as well. So I think we probably would live, but whatever. I mean, we got him to finish Bulma off with the crits and stuff like that. Huge support. He's a rainbow orb changer. I mean, he's huge. I, I, We probably will be using that legendary Super Saiyan Broly in this fight quite a bit moving forward. At rainbow orb changer, who could get guaranteed additional supers, that could help get us through the bullshit start of Th that that Bulma fight. That's very handy. Yeah, okay, wow. I, we were in the Bulma fight for quite a while, huh? We ended up in there for quite a bit. Uh, was a very fun... <laughs> fun for several reasons. Okay, I'm not sure where we're going next. Probably... Cell Max. Cell Max, I think. Alright, guys. Let's hop into the Cell Max fight. Um, let's see how we're gonna do. Uh, I took a small break. Um, I actually, in between, when we did, what was the last fight we did? It was Bulma. In between the Bulma, we have double, double Tech Broly, huh? In between the uh, Bulma fight and then now this one, I got another injection in my eyeball. Ah! All right, we're looking, we, we, we'll be looking good though, here. Um... I did go a little boring with the lineup, as you guys can see. I just went full uncontrollable power again. Um, what I was considering, believe it or not, was Broly Chai and Limo for a split second, but then I, I laughed. <laughs> I, I, like, I actually just sitting here by myself just laughed and said, no, I don't think I'll do that, actually. It, it, just, it just will completely kill the vibes. Right? Like, it's... We bring Broly Chai and Lemo, and then next thing you know, we're losing. Because it's, like, super easy a Broly. And we saw what he looked like with limited supers. So, essentially, we saw what he looks like without... With limited rainbow orbs. So, it's, like, that. that's the one thing about him. He doesn't really have the luxury of going without the orbs. By the way, I'm really trying to decide where I want to put AJ Broly, which is why I'm taking so long right here. Um, my... Six, three, even my seventh sense is telling me that the super attack is definitely in the middle slot, so. Let's, uh, conserve rainbow orbs all over the place. Alright, hopefully we don't get blown away right here. I mean, Broly will live, AJ Broly will live, but. Uh, now, we could, in Broly's domain, will buff the Cell Max boss, keep that in mind. Could have brought Bio Broly as well. I was thinking about bringing Bio Broly. Bio Broly could be a little bit iffy, I think, at the start of the fight. But it's not super difficult to predict where this Cell Max is going to super. I feel like it's very common for this guy to super with, like, his second attack. Later on in the fight, um, he begins to super instantly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Later on in the fight, he instantly supers. And we dodge that. Beautiful. That saves us a little bit. Of we would have taken a little bit of damage right there. That saves us a little bit of damage, which is good. Um, 
We definitely don't want super easy a Broly in front of the attacks. Uh, I guess we could... Throw out the domain. I guess we'll do it. I, this could be bad, but... Because, again, we are buffing uh, Cell Max himself, right? So it's not just like we're buffing ourselves. Cell Max is getting buffed by this also. Uh, this does, obviously, drastically power up uh, Int Broly, though. Although I am going to float him off right here. All right, we're able to get... That's four. Just like last turn, I'm going to bank... On... I'm gonna bank on him super with the second attack. I don't I don't think super easy April. He can't handle this super. There's no way. Definitely not. Alright, so we are gonna get, you know, three guaranteed supers right here, which is really good. Okay, very good. Uh, remember, he is guaranteed critting as well, which does matter quite a bit. Hidden potential system, additional normal, of course. Shit. And we don't dodge. Remember, people love their 30 additional builds just so they could do exactly that. Except they didn't have the chance to dodge like mine did right there. Um, alright. I mean, a little bit of a, you know, a little rough right there. I mean, that's how it goes against Cell Max. Um... I mean, I could have floated Broly, but, I mean, he is the showcase character. I typically don't like to float the showcase character if it's at, at all possible to not float them. Uh, all right, loading back. Okay, there we go. I was just, I was I, the, my finger was inching towards that pause button, dude. Uh, I think we'll just hop right back in. Same setup. We'll do double, double tech Broly. Now they want to give me an int Broly? Okay. I do think int Broly is a superior, like, double int Broly is probably a superior lineup. Uh, well, okay, let me change it to Int Broly is probably a, potentially a, a, like a safer lineup because with two Int Broly's, what it is is you can really just chain the domain up so that Int Broly himself will function as a slot one for all the important parts, aspects of the fight. That's why I think double Int Broly is better. Uh, I mean, Tech Broly can, uh, like, I don't, it's not that he can't go slot one, but it's just Int Broly without the domain is just really nothing special. I mean, I guess he can have his revive once you get to, like, turn five plus, but. No, oh, Christ. Uh, phew, damn. Yeah, we, okay, so right here, we have, it's, like, it's almost impossible for us to live if Cell Max supers in slot one, I think. Let's do this. All right, similar situation. Now, you guys know, again, I've got a proper build on my on my daddy right here. We got a good build on him. We got a good We're getting that hidden potential system additional, like, every single time, too, which is really good. All right, let's see. Uh, we do have uh, Carnival Tech Broly in slot, too, which means we have the extra support up. Because I, I saw that, uh, that Super Easy Broly's stats are a little bit higher. All right, hopefully this bastard does not just super attack instantly again. Again, we do have a, a decent chance of dodging it, though, so no worries. Yeah, definitely a full dodge on this guy, for sure, 100%. Double digits, so that's good. If he supers in slot three, we lose. Cool. Because um, uh, easy attack Broly, I actually don't have dodge shenanigans on him. I have, th th I have three dodge, because, of course, you, I mean, you... It's really, I, I think, actually asinine to not even go three dodge. But um, all I have on him is three dodge. The rest is just pure offense for this guy. So it does, it leads it to being very easy for him to get caught and killed at the start. Okay. Hidden potential system additional super is good. Nice. We got the crits and stuff. Very good, very good. You could tell that he has an offensive build because he does literally always crit. Um, I see no reason to plow through Tech Broly's abilities quick. I was considering for a second transforming Tech Broly right here, but nah. Don't super right away. Okay, good. I'll allow Cell Max to build up a little bit first before he gets it. 
Cell Mask could definitely take some real damage here. I mean, you guys could tell he was going to take a little damage from the normal. Right, it wasn't just a like cold blood of double digits. Okay. All right, here's the super right here. This will hurt. This is going to hurt. Ah, oh, that's, not, nah, that's not really bad. All right, so we have Int Broly in this next rotation. Um, I think I, I really would prefer not to die this time, I think. I will definitely consider floating super easy a Broly. I think if it's in our best interest here. I did decide to bring this guy, by the way. Um, because obviously with the true type advantage. It'll allow him to tank a little bit better, <clears throat> which is good. Remember that Cell Max does uh, have a, a cut for AGL character damage. That's awesome. Okay. Let's get uh, Daddy out. Okay. We will do this. Sure. L let's get the domain as well. Uh, Carnival Broly in slot one, so we're, we're going to be looking good. Okay, perfect. Now, I'm going to assume that Carnival Broly, this guy is probably like, again, probably 30 additional. Probably 30 additional. I'm sure. <laughs> All right, show me that 30 additional, additional build, my boy. Let's see. Get your guesses in. Uh, it's actually a little hard for me to see right now. It's 24 and 15. I, zero dodge is just silly, but could be worse. I saw the, he's got the the defense, the raw defensive equip. That's pretty good. Uh oh, we got cocked with rainbow orb changing, huh? This is the first time we've gotten cocked with his orb changing. Yeah, seems so. Uh oh boy. Okay. We could hit this. That's fine. Oh, well, actually, it does matter. I was going to say, it doesn't matter that we'll be able to get a third Rainbow Orb. Yeah, it does. It's extra support for the other two. I mean, give him this. Um, you know what? Actually, I think I will go for a 12 key super here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, it's only a, a lot of times people have been complaining so much in the comments of videos where we use him. Of, oh, my God, go for the 12 key. Most of uh, listen. Most of the time, it's not a big deal, especially with the way I play with Int Broly. But, I mean, like, right here is a good situation to go for the 12 key super 100%. Uh, if Sal Max super is back there. Because what it is is the 12 key super attack will give us a 50% chance to get 30% more defense. Which is, is, oh, okay. Actually, actually, looks like we're going to get a chance to take advantage of that. Perfect. Okay. Uh, I mean, there's no way really to tell if it procs. I mean, if we take double digits, maybe I'll assume it procs. All right, we got one more guaranteed super coming in. So he's now fully built up. Um, he's going to be hitting the crits. He's going to be doing a lot of supers and stuff like that. This Broly. So, I mean, he, he's going to be helping us out quite a bit. One more? No. No, we didn't. Okay. All right, 12 key super. A hidden potential system additional super would be lovely as well. I'm, I don't really want to take damage right now. We didn't get it. Uh, we got the... Do oh, okay. Yeah, don't worry. I know what I'm doing, guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> I think we had to tank that really well, but it just it just shows that... Yeah, I mean... <laughs> it just shows that I'm in a cackling mood. <laughs> All right, so we're starting to get a little bit deeper into the fight here. So I think that chances are elite that... This boy is super in right away. In which case, Cell Max will handle business for us. Damn, I wish, uh, yeah. I wish we can get to that 18 key, but it's all good. Uh, and we'll save the remainder of these Rainbow Orbs for next turn. Okay. Uh, as long as he doesn't super in slot three, which I, I don't, I don't think so. This guy gets very aggressive as the fight goes on. Notice at the start of the fight, the way it's designed is for Cell Max to, like, he does nothing and, like, like he, what it, he has a bunch of invisible, like, do-nothing actions, in, like, at, at, the, at the start of the fight, which is why it's so infrequent 
where he supers uh, in like right away. Damn. Okay. Yeah. He he's at he's the, okay. His buffed super attack effect. Notice how he was uh, he lowered Sal Max's defense there. Yeah. See, so he's starting to get nasty now. Berserker up. Oh hell yeah, it is. I think it is. Well, I'll be up. We'll be able to tell within two seconds on this uh, this next attack coming up. This is a fun run fighting Cell Max without like heavy debuffers. Are, yeah, I think it's up. I think Berserker is up. We're like right at the the threshold. I think it's up. It's up. <laughs> yep. Uh, yes, sir. That is up. All right. All right. So eighty five is pretty good. Crit. No, dude, you got a crit. Fifty one. Dude, 51 on an additional super. Ay, ay, ay. Can you calm down? Oh, no. He said no. Fuck that. No, hell no. Hell no. I'm not calming down. He should be completely fine, too. I mean, Cell Max is scary, but... Well, well our Cell Max... Oh, God. We got the God rotation from this guy. Sheesh. That's a lot of damage he did, man. That's a lot. He did a lot. He is, he is really good. Have we played this in the video? I don't remember because I recorded the first part of this like four hours ago. Oh. All right, guys. So, by the way, I think I'm I I am kind of towards the end of this video, feeling pretty good about Trunks and Goten as the number one TUR. Um, I do. I'm looking for four rainbows here, but I don't see it. Let's hit this. That's three. Three is still support, so that's good. We'll take it. And we'll take it. We'll take it. Um, I I think so. I think um, Trunks and Goten, number one, uh, and this guy, number two. Uh, but, uh, yeah, that, that's probably what I would say. I think I like this guy as the number two. Um, easy ATUR. He seems really good to me. The super easy April. Like, damn, Stelmox could actually do damage to him, huh? Yeah, again, don't guys, don't put zero dodge on this guy. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. This is a slot one character. You're going to want him... People aren't gonna, they're not gonna listen to me, and they're gonna, oh my god, like, but just, I mean, guys, just, not just spouting bullshit here. Alright, super easy, I probably will probably kill right here. We don't have to worry, I mean, I mean, this is, we're definitely in no danger. 26? Oh, we have Berserk up for him, too, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he's out of here. This isn't a guaranteed crit, though, um, because we got, uh, three rainbows, right, but still... 50% chance to crit. Yeah, he, he handles business. This guy is really good. This super easy A Broly. I, like, it's like exactly... I've said this many times. A lot of people are like, they love super easy A's because it makes these old-ass characters super relevant again. And it's like, I remember this Broly in particular, even I never had a chance for this guy to really be spectacular because when this guy got his easy A, um, I actually... I think I only had him 55% when this STR Broly got his easy A or something like that. I did not have him rainbowed when he first got his EZA. So, I, this is the first time ever I've been able to, like, seriously use him as a meta character, which is great. Um, you know, obviously. But I like Super EZA so much because it specifically really impacts villain teams. Super EZA is a villain saving mechanic added to this game and i mean do no further than just look backwards three in a row super easy a's are villains and all three of these villain super easy a's have had monster massive impacts on their teams right i mean dragon fists and gotenks were good as well super easy a is such a great thing to be added into this game man and it, it's nice to get another nice option for this kind of like movie bosses, uncontrollable power setup. Really good. Uh, let's head into the Blue Cow King Goku Evolution Blue Vegeta fight. We'll probably make that the last fight, I think. Alright guys, let's go ahead and jump into this bad fight. 
Well, I, I meant I meant like bad boy, like these bad boys fight right here, jumping in like this. Wait, I went in the wrong one. No, this is UI Goku. Oh my god, my vision right now is so poor. Look at me making mistakes, doing all this craziness. I jumped in the UI Goku. I'm such a silly Billy. We'll keep. We'll leave this in. We'll leave this in so you guys can get some chuckles, some ha-ha-ha-ha-ha's, <laughs> and some hee-hee-hee-hee-hee's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. We want to fight Blue Cock and Goku Evolution Blue Vegeta. That's a much harder fight than that UI Goku fight. And I don't want to use Tech Broly. I'm, I'm good, thanks. Okay. We want Int Broly for this one. Yeah, let's go. Perfect. All right, let's go. Give me good rotations, baby. Let's see. No, I th God damn this game. Now Super Easy April is in slot 7. We're like not even going to see this kid. Oh, okay. Yamero Broly! Yamero! Alright, um, let's go ahead and take a look at what we got here. I... Guys, I'm really, I'm really considering... Just backing out. But we won't. We won't, we won't, we won't. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm like thinking about just like backing out, man. I'm gonna intentionally hold back. Uh, cause, I mean, obviously we want super easy April to be able to actually, like, you know, participate in this opening fight. Okay, so, file this away. Here's a problem. You know, remember how, like, you know, we would see, like, I mean, people who just don't... How do I word this? Maybe sometimes I'm a little too, like, I don't know, just like dummies. <laughs> this, you know, never mind. Fuck that. I'm fucking idiots, okay? We go, oh my god, you gotta kill the boss. You gotta do damage to kill the boss. Damage is the most important thing. Damage, damage, damage. Super Easy Broly right now is in a spot in slot 7 where if, like, we, like, dub, like transform Tech Broly and we just absolutely, like, Blitzkrieg Blue Cow can Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta, we would be in big-time trouble. Evolution Blue Vegeta, based off of what we've seen, will easily be able to kill Super Easy Broly, right? Like, we've seen, like, Super Easy Broly class disadvantage, type disadvantage, you know, 3 million super... Like, his normals are going to be hitting harder than those normals that Bulma did. That did damage to him. So, it's like, if I just go, alright, let's just blow him away. And Broly shows up for the first time against Evolution Blue Vegito, we instantly lose. Because remember, he's also a dodge-canceling boss. Um, now, I mean, this, in order for this to happen, we, you know, did need this guy to start in slot 7, sure. But, I mean, guess what? That's the way it goes. Um, you know, and you know, when I go under the assumption of, you know, we got one run to win or, you know, the aliens like blow up the planet or something like that, you know, what if the one run, that's, that's the run where he starts out in slot seven. What then? Hmm? What then? Oh, then we're in trouble. We're in big trouble. Uh, let's trap one of these. Yep. This is a very scary turn right here. I love how, like, some of these animation skips, we still see a lot of the animation, right? Uh, if they super in slot 2, we're dead, and there's nothing we can do about it. I guess the 3 dodge can trigger. Yeah, I... Yeah, I think the 3 dodge can trigger. Um, okay. Let's move forward. I want the healing. Uh, 
I'd like to save those STR orbs for a potential... Uh, well, it's not the SCR orbs specifically, but I wanted those rainbow orbs to be saved for next turn, but it is what it is. All right, let's see how we do. How are you eating this? Uh, okay, they, they, they're they chipping away at us a little bit. Maybe I, I should have had my... I should have did that in reverse and had the other Broly do the active skill, get my Broly in slot one. Because, like, you know, him doing damage right there is not... We, we, we would have wanted... I want that 150k HP back. Oh, dude, there's no way. Oh, are they... Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. I was going to say, that, dude, they're just going to kill easy attack Broly in slot 2. That blows. Uh, it's conceivable that we'd live with the 3 dodge, but, I mean, I'm not, you know, betting the house on the 3 dodge. No way. Uh, we have had very good luck with this guy, by the way, keeping this guy hidden. Easy attack Broly at the start of fights. We've not really encountered problems where he gets demolished. He can, but we haven't really had that issue. Yeah, w th this is a dead run. Super easy a Broly in slot 7 is dead here. Like, what are we supposed to do? Yeah, getting him in slot, slot 7 is really bad. I mean, we can't run him in slot one. We also don't have rainbow orbs, unbelievably, here. Yeah, let's hit this. That gives us two. Ah, uh, damn. I think Super Easy April is going to die to normals in this, man. I think so. That's going to suck ass. Just just off starting in slot 7. Are we even going to be able to get a super in? Hopefully this guy just like does like normals and okay. <sighs> yep, shit happens. I guess we just try and kill his ass before Broly gets hit. We could probably do that. We're in Berserker territory. Easy, Broly will kill him. No, we're not in Berserker territory. Uh, I guess, I mean, we'll we'll do another run. True type advantage. He's safe in slot one. Get that. Uh, let's just start trying to set up rainbow orbs for Broly next turn. Perfect. Hit that. All right. Uh, so obviously against Evolution Blue Vegeta, my you know my normal dodging shenanigans bullshit do not work in here. They would if we had Tech UI Goku, but. Oh, nice hidden potential system additional super. I'll take it. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, we're, we're probably... We could really just kill... I, I think we'll kill Vegeta before he has a chance to punish Super Easy A Broly's normals. I kind of do want to show what happens, but I mean, at the same time, if we kill Vegeta before he gets a chance to punish Broly... Yeah, Easy A Tech Broly is pretty crazy, though, because, like, he suns these bosses before they get a chance to do anything, man. Look at this. Wow, we, we missed an additional right there. Did we not get the hidden potential system additional? I think we didn't, right? Is this clown really supering us in slot 3? Doesn't matter, he's dead, but... Don't confess, bro, we'll finish him off. Uh, okay, so that was a run where we didn't, like, see very much of Super Easy A Broly. Right? I mean, that's just, you know, starting out in slot 7. He's not critting. God damn it. I have mostly crit on this guy. I'm a little concerned of Vegeta with Super right here. Oh, nice. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. I think he jumped really. He could still have one more coming too, right? Beautiful. You're out of here. Uh, all right. Well, we saw almost nothing. The only impact Super Easy Broly had on that fight whatsoever was a little bit of support for Tech Broly and Slot 1. 
Isn't that crazy? Like, a character could, you know, show up in slot 7 and he have just, like, virtually zero impact on the fight. Like, just, like, it's as though they were invisible in this fight. That's why, like, like you know, like, watch one of those and then understand why a lot of times you'll see people, like, like they will try. It, it's a very common thing I see, I mean, where they'll produce a screenshot of, oh, the character's so bad, what's this? And it's, like, a, cle a, a run cleared. It's, like, congratulations. Is this slot 7 again? Yeah, no. I mean, I don't like to reset, but, like, we literally just saw that. He has no... He's in slot 7? Congratulations. He does nothing. He had no impact in the fight whatsoever. Oh, Lord. Here we go. We're just gonna over and over and over start in slot 7. Watch... Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. You guys want to see something funny? Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Okay. My finger was on that pause button. I was about to pause so fast. Ay, 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 ay. What a what an annoyance. This last run annoying the shit out of me here. Uh do we just not Damn Cell Max. I almost would like to not bring Cell Max to this fight. Maybe I I I, sh I should stop bringing him. What do you guys think? Just stop bringing Cell Max. Hmm. Just cause like we're we're gonna kill, like, dude, like we're gonna decimate these kids before we get a chance to do anything. We'll do this. Sure, intentionally hold back. I would like to not get those rainbows, but you know it is it is what it is. We'll hit this. No super? Okay, sure. Gonna need those rainbow orbs on this next turn. Alright, so it looks like they're aiming the super at Cell Max. Putting Cell Max in slot 1 was really dangerous. Uh, because if they would have supered right away, he would have gotten an additional super, and then he devastates this fight. I mean, he could just solo them, like, by himself in one turn. Oh, Lord, here we go. It's so hard to intentionally hold back, dude. Alright, they're super in right away. This will do a lot of damage. Instant first attack, super. On, and this is Sal Max's weakness for sure right here. Yep. That wasn't so bad, but... Just instant super. All right, so I guess we are kind of set up nice, potentially, to see Super Easy A Broly have to deal with Vegeta at least a little bit. I think I'm probably going to make this the last run regardless. Like, I've seen everything I need to see from Super Easy A Broly, um, and, I mean, he he's just a bad man, right? He's a bad boy. That's all it really boils down to. Really love him. Super easy. Just such a goddamn good mechanic. Alright, this, uh, uh... My phone is about to die, too, but... Uh, Nano, can we stop? God damn it. We have Tech Broly next turn, right? No, we don't. It's my god, they never stop supering. I, like, bosses need double the HP they've got. All right, we... Okay, okay, okay. We got bl bodied. Blasted. Uh-oh. Huh. Let's see. This will help? No. We're running out of RNG towards the end of the video, I guess? What What is going on? What? Okay. Uh, did you guys know that uh, Broly Rimp Orb changed? I bet you didn't. Couldn't tell right there, could you? We had no key whatsoever. Great. 
damn it. That's that's bad for Super Easy A Broly, too, because now, I mean, he could really, like, get destroyed by Vegeta. Eight million. That's the highest we've seen from him with his first attack. As with Berserker up, right? Alright, here's the second one. This is the hidden potential system additional super right there. That's what that was. Oh, then the dodge triggers. Okay. Uh, either easy attack probably kills him or we lose, I think. Probably. Okay. Ooh, normal. That's no good. Oof. Very good. Very good. Very good. Yeah, uh, I mean, I'm sorry, but I mean, I guess our key just sucked ass right there. Is more so the issue. <sighs> God damn it. Ay, 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 ay. That's, that's a very, 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 very tough occurrence right there, the, the way our key looked. It's all right. We'll fight through it. All right, hopefully Tech Broly doesn't get killed again. Let's hope. Okay, that's very good for us. <laughs> sure, I'll take that. So, right, about what I... Uh, about uh, Easy Tech Broly. I don't think we'll have uh, any concerns. Bro, I can't believe people... People are really planning to run Super Easy Broly with Broly, Chi and shit Shitmo. No, no way, right? Oh, damn it. My phone is dying. For real. Shit. Damn. I... I'll be able to... It's... Yeah, it's about to die in two seconds. We're not even going to be able to get through this turn. It's three. Alright, we'll hit this. Alright, um, I guess, damn, I guess I gotta take a slight break to let it charge up a little bit. Because I can't, the, the device Nano gave me is like so, oh, there we go. Nah, it died. <laughs> That's bullshit. That is bullshit. You guys saw how it said 3% right there, right? I know you guys saw how it said 3%. It went from 3% to... Oh, actually, no, it's dead. <laughs> that was bullshit. Okay, sure, sure, sure. We'll come back in two seconds. All right, guys, we're coming back. We're coming back. I think I got enough juice to just end the video uh, with a bang right here. So, yeah, super easy, a legendary Super Saiyan Broly. Um, I think he is quite good. Um, I think Dokkan did a good job. Um, I... I guess, it, like, not every single celebration needs a super easy A. Um, I do think, like, they skipped one with Tanabata, and I think that that was fine. Um, but I do really feel like they could have and should have done a super easy A um, for the Master Roshi celebration. Um, that Roshi team really could use... I mean, well, what they want is a tank character. I feel like they don't typically make easy A characters like real cold-blooded tanks, like... Like, I don't know, like, Beast or something like that. Like, like Tech Ultimate Gohan can tank, but... Alright, did they... Oh, damn. Really? Huh. We... Yeah, okay. So, we, we took a little bit of damage right there. Hmm. So, right at the start, it, it could take him a little bit. Yeah, I think Trunks and Goten... I'm okay putting Trunks and Goten slightly in front, I'm thinking slightly slightly in front he th this broly is really good though at it like it's like once he's built up obviously he's pretty good but when you consider his support I, man dude him dropping like 80 percent support on some of these t on some of these turns and stuff like that is so crazy we did get the one turn by the where he we had a, you know five rainbow orbs, a hundred percent support to extreme class is really crazy. All right, Cell Max, 
A lot of juice right there. Uh, we'll be able to finish this off with uh, uh, Egil Broly. Whoops. Oh, no, 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 no. I got I to gotta get this. I got to get it charging. I got to... So, yeah, again, um, the nano device, the nano recording method is what I call this. It's like... It's hard to explain, but the record device is like... It's, it, it's pretty tough to explain. All right, let's see here. Um... Huh. Well, you know what's not good right here? Oh, damn close. I'll tell you guys what's not good. And that's the fact that we have no links up on this turn. Zero links. There we go. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. You guys see we're at 11% right there. All right, I got I to gotta hold it in place. Pre with my old recording method, I could, like, get it recording. No, there's no way Vegeta's going to. No, no, he's not. Nah, no way. Okay. Hit him, but then just some additional normal like every single fucking time. Okay. Whew. We were at double digits. I'll take the double digits, though. Um, now, remember, Vegeta gets a massive attack buff when he supers, though. So, like, we could see stronger supers from him. All right. And then now we're going to be able to just finish this off. Woo! Crazy, 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 crazy. What a video. What a video. All right, no domain up is unfortunate. Um, okay, let's get Tech Broly transformed. Let's get you with that up right there. Uh, we could rock Cell Max in slot one right here, huh? Let's do that. I think that's it. Fight's done. We could put Cell Max in slot one. Cell Max is guarding with damage reduction with plus a million defense. Damn, I was kind of hoping Vegeta would super attack right away. Because um, that would have allowed us to absolutely just devastate Vegeta with an additional, guaranteed additional super. That did not do very much damage. Okay. You want a crit, bud? I think I do have a nearly full crit build on Cell Max, right? Okay, he forgot he could crit. Great. All right, here's this. This is not going to be a problem for Salmax. Yep. Does that put us in Berserker territory? <laughs> you idiot. No, it doesn't. No, no, we no, we don't have Berserker. No, Berserker's not it. No. Vegeta's not even strong enough to put Berserker up for us. Thanks. Thanks, bud. I hate the Berserker link so much. Ah, damn it. Such a specific HP condition you gotta be under. Man, wh when they... The link level update, for them to not get rid of the HP restriction, but instead to just increase damage was such a dumb idea. Berserker would be so much better if you would drop the damage, but then just remove the HP restriction. It'd be a better... A much better link. Right, so uh, at link level 1, I believe Berserker is 20% attack when under 50% HP. They should have just made it 20% attack with no HP condition. I think would have been fine. It could lead to some big numbers, which people love, but I, overall, I mean, I like... You would get so much more damage from the consistency of always having it up. Would equate to way more damage. Well, all right. There we go. Uh, super easy A Broly, guys. Uh, he's a bad boy. That, that is a bad boy right there. He's a bad boy. We did see some turns where he was capable of taking damage and stuff like that. But, I mean, when you can... He's putting up a lot of support. 
He does have some defensive ability. I'm loving this Broly right here. 